your hands are really dexterous things. We use them every day for all sorts of tasks. To make the best use we possibly can of that is to build a puppet around the hand so knuckles become knees or elbows. But at the end of the day, it's all the illusion of movement. My name's Barnaby Dixon, I'm a puppeteer. Is that all right? I'm 26 years old and I started making puppets two years ago. This is Dab Chick. This is the first puppet I ever made. This is Manu, and it takes two hands to operate this puppet. And this is the dinosaur. I think this is the most expressive puppet that I have. I make them in my room, really. Each of these puppets represents maybe two months' work, and it's, it's a process that's driven completely by trial and error. The materials to make these puppets, I usually can just get them online, raw bits of metal or plumber's epoxy, just things like that really. Hey, Barnaby Dixon here. I made the puppets originally with the purpose to create uh, video content on YouTube. So check this out. Most weeks I'll take Dab Chick out for an outing where I'll film it. Ah, the great British seaside. Soft, wet sand, oh joy of joys. I always do try and make them funny. The proud fury of the waves thundering to a ball. I do get self-conscious about uh, having the puppets out and about. Some people just think I'm an adult playing with a toy. People kind of don't know what to think of it. Wunderbares nämlich Barnaby. Hallo. So recently I was on a German talent show that, that was about puppets. It was called Die Puppen Stars. And I ended up winning this. It was very validating and so I think, yeah, a lot of people would think it's quite a weird thing for a 26-year-old to be in his bedroom making puppets. But it's working out for me, so... Ha! Huh. <laughs>